6,001, 6,002, 6,003, 6,004. Only another few more thousand digs to go and I might have finally buried this obstacle. So, my name's Shane Alassara. I'm 46, live on the Gold Coast and I live and breathe obstacles. So I'm currently here uh, organising uh, an event with a company. Uh, it's an obstacle course called Beach Warrior. And uh, they've used us to set up quite a few different obstacles uh, for their amazing event. So I feel honoured to be invited. Um, but yeah, I'll just uh, tell you a little bit about myself, uh, who I am, what I do, um, why I do it, and why I love Ninja Warrior, and why I think I'd be suitable for next year's winner. So with with my company Terrain Training, I organise obstacles that we set up for private events, uh, for fundraisers, for commercial events, for birthday parties, shopping centres, schools, you name it, we're involved with it. And we've only just recently gotten into uh, inflatables as well. Um, but without talking too much more about the company, we uh, organise, if you can have a look over here and walk around with me, this is just one of the obstacles that we have. It's a inverted wall. So oh, I may as well demonstrate. Uh, anyway, the, uh, the, dig the digging can hold and wait for now because I hate it. So going here, underneath, up, up the wall, over on this huge yellow and red wall. And because of an edge, I will jump off. Get straight up. Like that. Uh, so yeah, this is one of many. Uh, we've got plenty of monkey bars, uh, plenty of sand. Cool to go to beach. If you turn around and you have a look, it's absolutely amazing here. Gold Coast there over to the left. There's an aeroplane just up there in the sky. You know, things that you haven't seen here in the Gold Coast. Uh, but anyway, I love my job. I get to go and uh, experience Australia for what it is and this is a beautiful place and uh, everybody wants an obstacle course. So, um, I have a three and a half year old son. He's my little ninja. I'll make sure I'll put some footage on the application as well. So you can see that he is an absolute beast. He loves to take after his dad. Uh, my wife, Ronnie, uh, she's an aerialist. She also has an aerial artistry uh, school where she teaches all of her students to do aerials. Uh, so Cirque du Soleil, uh, circus, silks, lira, all those amazing things. And uh, yeah, we're a really tight knit, we're an active family. And uh, for me, I just love obstacles. I've always uh, enjoyed Ninja Warrior, all the way back to when it was on uh, television on SBS in Japan. And uh, I love watching American Ninja Warrior. Uh, I've been lucky enough to uh, have the experience of season one and season two here in Australia. Uh, I'd love to have the opportunity in season four. I'm a lot better, a lot more skilled, a lot more adept to uh, different uh, types of challenges. Um, Ninja Warrior based, it's all I have to do anyway. Um, for my age group, I'm actually the number one in the country uh, for, in Australia. So I'd like to uh, just keep on working on that and improving and uh, being the number one in the world. And that also includes getting up uh, Mount Midoriyama. So. That's a little bit about me guys, I'm really excited, um, looking forward to uh, getting my teeth uh, you know, into the uh, Season 4 Challenge and Ninja Warrior 2021, well 2020, far out, I'm a year ahead of myself, so Season 5, we'll worry about that later, Season 4, bring me on. Okay. <laughs> get it, turn around, get it. Yes. I did it. Yay. 
I sure did. And can you put your legs up? No. <laughs> yep. 